what is happening guys and welcome back to G Light Travels. In today's video I have a very very special guest for you. So continue watching if you want to see who this special guest is. We're going to do a little bit of a, a Q &A with him. <laughs> oh no! And it's been revealed here he is! <laughs> okay good morning Polishek and welcome to uh, this new video today. How are you doing? I'm very good thank you very much for having me. Hello guys, hello YouTube, how are you doing guys? Excellent, excellent. Can you just tell us a little bit about yourself, where you're from uh, and what you do? All right, uh, thank you very much for inviting me. Uh, my name is Paweł, I or originally come from Poland. Uh, I got lots of different little passions, hobbies, slash interests. Uh, yeah, I'm a full-time, uh, I'm, I'm having full-time job. Uh, I'm working approximately between 40 and 50 hours a week. And uh, in my free time, I'm trying to fulfill my passions. One of those is uh, resetting, but I guess you will ask me anyway mm. what I'm doing. Uh, yeah, I like to stay active in terms of uh, sports. I play basketball, table tennis. I love my spending time with my son. I should say that at first. Yeah. But yeah, uh, yeah, that's it. Cool. You, you said resetting. What was this resetting? Reselling, yeah. reselling. Uh, okay, so how to compress that in not many complicated uh, <laughs> sentences? Reselling, I would say, is just buying cheap. Reselling online or physical for more money uh, mm. and get some profit, in, you know, out of it. Cool, cool. Okay, excellent. Well, the yeah, the purpose of this video is not to talk about reselling, but obviously that's a, an interesting uh, side hustle that we do. Um, so let's talk about YouTube because you have. Your own YouTube channel. What was the name of your YouTube channel? My YouTube channel is called Polashek. It's a kind of combination hybrid of my surname and mm. translated, converted into a manageable kind of world for the, everybody you know around the globe. Uh, because originally my Polashek surname is quite difficult to pronounce. Mm. Okay, excellent. Um, and what kind of content do you have on your channel? Well, my content initially was reselling oriented, but you know what? I decided to be more direct, more. <laughs> I decided to be more uh, versatile in terms of my content. Uh, I mm. wanted to share not only one specific niche in there, I wanted to be a little bit more kind of free, uh, if you wish. So yeah, my, uh, my YouTube channel is constantly growing. Who knows what kind of concept you know, my YouTube channel is going to bring in a few weeks, in a few months. Mm -hmm. At the moment, I'm concentrating mostly on reselling activities uh, means magnet fishing and uh, exploring mm. different areas and um, yeah sounds good sounds good okay well I won't um, won't ask you any more questions about your YouTube channel because people will need to check it out for themselves but what I would like to ask you is how did you get into YouTubing when did you start why did you start good question <laughs> thank you very much for asking me that well uh, as we know, YouTube is not that old at all. The platform has been growing over the years. Uh, initially, when I came over to England, I couldn't express myself in English properly. Now, I'm okay to you know, say whatever I want. Mm -hmm. And I found Greg uh, uh, on the YouTube channel one day, and I found different guys who is just, just doing their, their job, basically just expressing themselves, sharing their opinions, sharing the knowledge, sharing their life kind of activities. Mm -hmm. And I said to myself, you know what? There is no no perfection and no perfect time to start YouTube channel. Let's do it mm. now. Yeah, I mean, no. My, my main goal of channel creation was many years ago, as I said. As I, as I emphasized, I wasn't very confident in terms of my communication, mm -hmm. and I thought I'm not good enough. Mm. But um, yeah, I mean, uh, there is a lot of different content, lots of different direction you can take your YouTube and you know start making videos. But uh, I was inspired by, for instance, in terms of communication and talking to people, I was inspired by one of the Polish guy who is interviewing uh, homeless people. Mm. And he made me think how he's, you know, how he's approaching homelessness, you know, within different cities mm -hmm. in Poland. And then he evolved in different countries as well. Yeah, he just made me think. And then I started digging, out, digging a little more. And I obviously met Greg and mm -hmm. all different YouTubers about reselling and you name it, everything. Excellent, excellent. Okay. Um, okay, Pavel, what would you say are the best and worst aspects of being a YouTuber? Best aspects and good aspects about being a YouTuber. Good question, another one. Uh, personally, I, personally, I don't see myself any bad aspects, to be perfectly honest. Mm. I, every negativity, every stuff coming to me and 
make me awkward, difficult or nervous. I take, take it as a entrepreneur, as a apprenticeship kind of training period. Hmm. I'm just learning from that. Hmm. Nothing, nothing's gonna stop me from doing what I really want. And I, I think there is a lots of lots of more positive aspects in terms of making YouTube videos because the you know the the content, the the, the, the information, the the opinion you can share to the whole globe is much more valuable. Uh, actually, than uh, you know, some haters, some unhappy people behind mm. the monitors trying to bring you down or you know criticize whatever you do. Yeah, I'm not perfect. Mm. I'm not a uh, you know like any uh, uh, like, and I'm not even close to the perfection in terms of YouTube. YouTubing, I'm still learning. is an endless progress, I think, and the process of learning. And yeah, I just love it. Uh, yeah, I wouldn't say there is. Mm. In my personal view, there is no bad aspects in terms of being YouTuber, apart of obviously criticized, but mm. you know what, it's up to you what you're going to do with it. Yes, yeah, that's a very good point. So what would you recommend for someone who's just starting their YouTube channel and they get some negative comments or they get from uh, from the, the actual video they posted or they get ne negative comments from friends and family, like, oh, that's a waste of time, YouTubing. What would you say to them? Yeah, uh, <clears throat> interesting, interesting. Well, first of all, you have to ask yourself, whatever you do in life, Will people criticize you what you do or be negative or pessimistic about it? Mm. Of course they will. So this leads us to the conclusion, why would you care? You know, you're doing the stuff, you've got your own little vision and concept in your mind. You want to share the knowledge or share your personal life or whatever in mm. you. People will be always unhappy. Your neighbors will be unhappy. Your family will be unhappy. Ask yourself, what is most important? Their opinions or your willingness to express yourself? Mm. Okay, so why should people subscribe to your channel? <laughs> okay, Whoa, wow, I didn't expect that. <laughs> well, guys, uh, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I, I reckon you should go with me along my journey and uh, join me on my journey of being a foreign in English country. I came over in here a long time ago. Believe me, I couldn't speak English. I think that there's a plenty of people being, uh, you know, very kind of introvert in terms of their expressiveness, and they maybe they're not really happy with who they are or unhappy on the current state of their life. Mm. I tell you what, doesn't matter where you are, you can join me on my journey, and I guarantee you, I'll bring you some good content in terms of selling online, making some extra money. I'm not millionaire. I'm not living mm. in, uh, you know, the most luxurious property in, in around the globe. I'm just enjoying my life, having a good time in the beach, mm. meeting fantastic people, making connections with ex ex you know, extremely nice and friendly people. Obviously, there is uh, some percentage of negative up, mm. up there, but you know, as I said pre previously, you won't care about that. Mm. And yeah, uh, I think you, know, you might enjoy my content, uh, learn maybe a little bit from that, and hopefully you will get a little smile on your face from time to time. Mm. Excellent. Um, what, what's been your most popular video and why do you think? Have you had a video that you posted and that's been significantly more popular than others? Okay, good question. Uh, let me think about it. Well, at the moment, uh, my current status of my qual quantities in terms of videos, I have 56 videos. Uh, yeah, I've started, uh, my, my, my YouTube journey is constantly evaluating, uh, not evaluating, uh, evolve, evolving, mm. evolving and changing directions. I mean, at the moment, as I said, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to concentrate on the reselling, magnet fishing, spending time, being free, mm. enjoying my life, uh, treasuring and kind of exploring the areas, meeting new people as well, like yourself. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, uh, I remember as far as I know, uh, talking to homeless person randomly, literally I was walking through and met this guy on the on the street, mm. asking him specific questions, uh, you know, finding out the roots of the problems in his life. Uh, yeah, for some reason, you know, had uh, quite significant uh, views at this time. Mm. But I don't think there's a, you know, there's a gold solution for video algorithm in terms mm. of YouTube is very hard subject. There's to no tackle, secret strategy. No secrets. <laughs> you just do your videos, you know, share on uh, on YouTube, and hopefully, uh, YouTube algorithm will like it. Mm, excellent answer. Okay, good. Um, how, how do you motivate yourself to make videos, make new content when you're having a bit of a, a bad day? You're feeling a bit demotivated, deflated? Yes, very good question. I like that question. I think this is the best question actually so far. Uh, 
guys, believe me or not, on my YouTube channel I might appear very smiley and enthusiastic, but believe me or not, I got 30% of my daily schedule being miserable sometimes or mm. down or out of energy. If you find good solutions on systematic base, how to you know kill this kind of state of mind, uh, this is gonna be fantastic for you to kind of uh, you know stay consistent in, ter in terms of your you know uh, positiveness and trying to stay focused. Mm. Uh, yeah, the best for that's what I'm saying. I don't, I don't want to be saying there's a gold solution for everyone. For me personally, what works is a sport: playing basketball, running, uh, cycling, uh, meeting random people, talking about you know life and you know how they react to this kind of solution. Maybe learn from them and apply, implement, implement those their rules into your own life. Trying. If it doesn't work, try a different one. Just mm. constantly being authentic and um, not going over the tops. Stay humble, stay down. Talk to people, ask them for you know how they doing, and uh, maybe they will help you. If not, just keep going. And most importantly, don't give up about the haters. As I said, doesn't matter what you do, they always yeah. will be there waiting for you. <laughs> and uh, yeah, Murphy, Murphy Law, they're gonna catch you anyway. Yeah, yeah, haters gonna be hating. Just let them hate okay excellent so my last question is what does the future hold for polish x channel ha, the future holds guys the future is gonna be brilliant for me i know that deep inside my heart uh, you know um i do anticipate some fantastic projects on my youtube channel i do like to explore in different areas of my life uh, this channel is not about, about me i mean um, obviously i'm I have to have goals, specific goals, otherwise it's going to be difficult to grow. Um, I do anticipate some, you know, good uh, relationship with people, probably I don't know at this time yet. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, as you know, I'm open person, you can see on my channel, I, I don't give a damn what people think of me if I talk to them and they, what this guy is talking about. I don't really give a damn, guys, I just mm -hmm. keep going, I got my own goals, I play basketball and I want to teach people how to stay authentic and sometimes it's gonna be painful painful sometimes it's gonna be miserable mm. uncomfortable and awkward but i guarantee you be authentic be open and f haters <laughs> hey guys i hope you enjoyed that video um yeah i hope you enjoyed listening to to Polacek and what he had to say uh, about his channel Here's a link in the description to check out his channel. Please go and check it out. He has a lot of fantastic reselling content, um, places about where he lives at home uh, in Bournemouth, um, and interviews with various people. So yeah, go and check it out for yourself and see, see what you think. Um, so yeah, that, that's it for today. Please make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. And I hope you've enjoyed this video. Bye for now.